Most people are using the new Claude Sinet 4.5 model wrong. I'm going to show you this absolutely broken cheat code that lets you use it to build a fully automated content repurposing machine in just a few minutes. This works by leveraging Claude Flow and Claude Code Sinet 4.5. Flow has a hive mind feature that basically works similarly to worker bees and the queen in a bee colony. Claude acts as the queen for your task and orchestrates tasks to worker bees or smaller agents that work on different tasks at the same time. In this scenario, Claude orchestrates the worker agents repurposing our YouTube script into different platforms where each of them work on a different platform. And because of Claude code, this all happens inside your computer, which makes referencing files way easier. So here's how you get started. First, get Claude code. Now to install it, go to your project path and paste this line in from their website. That's it. If you want to run it, just go to whatever project path you want to use it on and type Claude. But we won't be starting it up yet. Next, we're going to get HiveMind. All you need to do to set this up is to paste this line from their repository into your terminal. Now paste this line to set up HiveMind. Go to Collective Memory, then Import Memory, then just hit General. Now we're going to load in our context profiles to add context about our business and target audience. If you're new to this whole process, I have the free guide on how to make context profiles in my description. Now we're just going to paste them all in one by one. And by the way, to save this editor, just type colon W Q and it should save and exit. If it still doesn't let you, try pressing escape and then typing it. Now, before we do anything, we need to start engineering a prompt the workers can use. But don't worry, I did all the heavy lifting. You can find all the prompts in the description. What you're going to do is go to your project directory, make a new folder, name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it prompts. Now we're going to make text files for each platform and paste the corresponding prompt for each file. Also add your YouTube script as a text file here. Okay, now we're going to start the swarm. Run the same command as before to set up HiveMind. Now click set up swarm. Now tell it to just refer to the prompt in your prompt folder. Name it whatever you want. Next, pick the roles for each worker. Boom, within a few minutes, it orchestrated the entire content creation process. And as you can see, it repurposed the videos into a blog, newsletter, five real scripts, a LinkedIn post, and even a Twitter thread, all in a few minutes. But yeah, boys, thanks for watching. If you want more source, join the Telegram in the description. Peace.